Okay, so I've been coding, doing all this stuff. Um, been looking into this stuff. What you'll want to do to make this is go into your notepad, type in this stuff. It took me a while to figure out how to do it. I also did this one is for the one that I named as Minecraft and that one's different one there. Here, I'll show you how to do a different one. Alright. First off, if you want to pull up the command prompt, it'll make your computer pull up the command prompt. You do start. Start. And start. Now we'll just do that. And then what you do is copy this. And you can just keep pasting. You can only do it a certain amount of times, I think, before it. Um, it like doesn't like allow you to do it anymore. Uh, then you do at echo off. Um, okay. Uh, yeah. So that's all you do right there. Then that's all you have to do if you just want to do a simple one. And this one here that I have on the screen here. I'm dragging around is the same one as this one right here. That's what it'll look like with the gears. Unless you can go in and you can change your icon, like the you can change the picture, so you can change it to look like Google Chrome. You can change it to look like any of these, and you can change the name on it to any of these. Um, yep. And then to what you want to do is go hit by this is all you have to do for a simple one. This is all you have to do. And then when you're done, just hit file, save as. I like saving it to my desktop because it's easy to find. And then type in whatever you want. Um, I just typed in a random thing on my keyboard. Okay, now we'll just do. Uh, Then you want to save it as a batch file, .bat, that's what you want to save it as. And this is a text document, so we'll save this as a text document. And then you hit save. When you save it, this is what it'll look like. Click on it. And that happens. That's the simple one. Then you just go through and... There's other ones. I have a shutdown one. I'm not going to click on that because if I click on that, it'll shut my computer down. And you can add the shut one, shutdown. You can add this into this. So you can do add shutdown one into this. So once it does that, after it goes through all that, it, it opens your command prompt. It'll shut it down then. Um, I'm trying to remember what's what now. Uh, Alright, here's another cool one that I made. this pops up a virus has been detected on your computer um, press any key to prevent file deletion then when I hit enter it'll go through your hard drive and then at the bottom down here you say your files have now been deleted press any key to continue press it and it goes off you can make like I said, a lot more um, high-tech ones. I did make some, and um, it's pretty fun. It's like a fake virus, pretty much. It's a fake virus, pretty much, and um, you can send it to people through email, and they'll click on it. And sometimes people think it's real, <laughs> but anyway, just thought I'd show you that. And I might want here. Um,
That's not what I wanted to do. Yeah, this is just this one. Uh, the shutdown one, as I said, that one just shuts it down. Let me click on it. Um, right there's one. Not with the new, that's just what I named it. But this right here, that will, um, go through and shut your computer down. That one will shut your computer down. Um... You're just random things that are sitting around. Whoops. Okay. Um my computer's slow. And we'll restart that. Oh now it loads. I have to use Internet Explorer and Internet Explorer for this, and Internet Explorer is really slow. This uh, this is something that only me and a couple other people have. Um, yeah. Pretty cool. Hey, um, that's about it. Just wanted to spread that out there. But that's, uh, something cool to do.